Rochester police have released more details about an officer-involved shooting last night. Chief James Shepard held a late morning news conference, and White Men's Mike Hedin was at that conference. He joins us now from the Public Safety Building. Hi, Mike. Hi, Katie. Chief Shepard said that police were called last evening to the area of Bay Street and Portland Avenue shortly after 8 o'clock at the request of a store employee. Now, Shepard says that's an area where individuals are engaged in outdoor drug sales. Officers Cody Goodfriend and Michael Collins stepped out of the store with two males. While they were patting them down, they saw and felt the, a gun in the waistband of Tyshawn Johnson. Johnson then broke free of the officers and fled on foot. The officers chased him and in, uh, near, in an area near the area of the Gantt Community Center, took him into, uh, shots were fired after uh, Johnson allegedly displayed a handgun as he turned toward police, and that's when Officer Godfrey fired, striking Johnson in the torso. I think due to the fact that, uh, number one, he was armed, number two, he was running from us, and he wasn't running backwards, and um, based on the fact that he protested and didn't display it, I, I think it's, uh, and again, we're in our preliminary stages, and I don't want to, uh, jump to conclusions myself, but uh, based on the circumstances, uh, it is very uh, likely to occur in that manner. Uh, when we encounter someone who is armed, it, it, you know, a lot of times we just have to deal with that circumstance, and when our lives feel threatened, we're going to um, deal with, with deadly physical force. Shepard said Johnson was in possession of a 410 shotgun with a sawed-off barrel and stock. He was uh, taken into custody and then also sent to the hospital where he is in guarded condition. He's been charged with criminal possession of a weapon. Officer Goodfriend has been reassigned to administrative duty. Katie? All right, thank you. Mike Hedin reporting from the Public Safety Building today.